hello my name is Ben today I would like to show you how to turn on the differential on a brand new Freightliner Cascadia on a 2024 model so let's say your truck got stuck in a facility on gravel sand or maybe it's winter time maybe it's stuck on ice or maybe you draw under the trailer and you cannot move out you know I mean the wheels are spinning it's slipping only one axle is digging in as long as much as more as you dig in the more trouble will be for you what i would like to recommend is locking up the differential turning off the traction control and trying to move out let me show you how you can do it so you go to your truck start it let's wait for the system to load up Make sure you do have a completely full air pressure, your brakes are released, I mean your brakes are fully pumped up. You need to go to the chassis, to axles. You see there is a truck sign and there is a differential, uh, like a light. Now it's blue. What it means is that differential is unlocked. We do have a lock interaxle button here. So what we need to do is to press the brake pedal, we press this lock button. You see, there is no changes on this blue light. So what you need to do to engage the differential lock, you actually need to release the brakes and you need to move the truck. So let's say you're, you're having a trouble to move, once you will put it in drive, you put it in drive or reverse, whatever you need, you try to move it. see it's it's turning on into yellow one now it's so what this yellow light means it means your differential is turning on so your both axles are spinning same time the axles are locked up if turning on the differential lock alone did not help what I would like you to try is to turn on the traction control. Press the ATC spin button, you will get traction control deactivated and it will help, it, the engine will not reduce the power to the wheels, you will have more power, you will have a bigger chance to move out. If you are on a, some slight hill, I also recommend you turning on the HSA off, you turn it off so what it does, it do, do allows you to move if you're on some downhill, uphill or whatever. You know, maybe the power was reduced because of that hill. After you got out from this uncomfortable situation, you never should drive with axles locked up. You can damage differential, you can damage tires. It's not recommended at all driving with axles locked. So what you need to do, you disengage this Axle lock, it's gone to blue color again. That's it. We are good to go. But make sure you always unlock it after you used it. And of course, since we disconnected our traction controls, we can simply connect it back. So we have no more lights on dashboard. We're out of the situation we didn't want it to be. I hope it helped. Make sure you press a like on this video, you subscribe to my channel, and ask if you do have any comments.